Hey guys, gals, and Legionnaires, Rykon here, and welcome back to Reigns. Poor Geralt has passed away in the night due to old age, which is something pretty rare for one of our kings. Um, and he's become something of a legend. He's been enshrined, and so we are going to continue as our heir. And if I'm correct, it should be the one that we were uh, having chats to the last one. Adamir. I'm Adamir. A Adamir. I'm I'm not 100 percent I know some of you are going to be able to correct me on this, but I'm going to go with Adamir for now, uh, just because that that seems to make sense to me. Unfortunately, we weren't able to do any of those goals though, so I do really need to start trying to work on those. Um, the good thing is that we do have um, some of these bonuses still in play, which is great. We're going to try and make the most of those. Okay, so let's see. A fat guy with a fake beard and a red coat is giving gifts to random children in the streets. Santa, Santa. Not my concern. Executioner. Um, not my concern. We'll let those go down for now. The river drop is flooding a large part of the country. We need help from the church and the army. Um, yes. Sure. Uh, no. Let the people, um... Oh gosh. It's gonna, it's gonna drop everything down. But I suppose the good thing is that, is that we can just attempt to build everything back up. Okay, Lady of Karkovia. Let's see. The people of a western village are afraid of goblins. Who should take care of this? I think she should. Okay, Henry the Bold. The invading armies are using our trebuchets, are using trebuchets to destroy our fortifications. We should be able to defend pretty well because we have our high walls. So, we will do oh, okay. And they're gone. And they're gone. Um, right. So I guess there is kind of like a a saving blow if we were super low. So maybe next time we'll try and hold on to it for a little bit longer. Oh dear, poor Adamir has already lost the walls that his father built. Okay, I have a price for you, but a, a gift for you, <laughs> but it has a price. You will have to prove you're a worthy king. Yes. Is it the same? Okay, govern, govern 15 years with the ailments of old age and again we will talk. Okay, we've had this before, we weren't able to do it, so I'm hoping that we will be able to. So, Azamir is going to be given a muddled mind of sorts, so uh, we will do our best to rule for 15 years. Okay, oh dear, okay. Uh, could we dismember Junius Lostung? Okay, um... Let's see, Junius Loose Tongue, let's pull him up, okay. He was playing tennis with a giant. Go away, pay the army. I will make him pay the army. Oh, we, that was us paying the army, fantastic, great, okay. Uh, they would like to build a school. Uh, that would be fantastic, but we don't have the money to do so, so we, <laughs> we're we running into trouble. Um, okay, let's see, our relations with the East are deteriorating quickly. They're far richer than we. What are the options? Okay, what are the options? What about a good crusade? Yes! Yes, yes, yes. A good crusade would be fantastic. It's probably going to be bad for people. It's going to be bad for army, but it's going to be good for money. No, surely not. Oh, wow. Okay, we're going up money every year. Okay, all right. So we need to be very careful with this. We are actually on a crusade at the moment. Oh, dear gosh. Okay, let's see. The slaughter of infidels is a lucrative way to decrease your population each year. Okay, we need to move fast. The population is going down. Uh, let them go. No pity. Okay, we're run out of people already. Okay, fantastic. Wow, the crusade is not easy at all. So what's happening is the money is going up, but the people are going down constantly. So I think when you go into crusade, you need to have a either have not a lot of money and a lot of people. It just goes so damn quick. That's really tough. But um, unfortunately, poor Adamir, the crusader, he managed to go on a crusade, which is one of our goals. But here he only ruled for a very short amount of time. Poor Adamir, the crusader, didn't manage to do much. But we have William. He is our 13th king. Uh, end a crusade. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that's a pretty good goal. We'll attempt to do that as well. But we also do need to start our omens. And the crusade is still going. Okay, the ship has been quarantined. Okay, all right. Yes, uh, we shall close the port. Okay. Would you like to rip a basilica? Uh, yes, we would, so we can get money down. Okay, all right. Let's see. My liege, we are under attack. Beggars are invading the streets. Throw them out. Let them be. Uh, okay, we will. we will let them be. We need to keep people up a bit. Boris the Talman. I'm just, I'm because I'm trying to read as fast as I can. I will show you the righteous way to behold your merchants. Please, no, I can pay. Yes. 
I will show you the righteousness to behold your merchants. Okay, we'll let the money go down. That's okay. Brooding, but with your money. Okay. All right. Whispering. Okay, Sliver and Snake sneaks into your sleeve. Get lost. Okay, yes. We need to be fast here. We need defenses. Okay, defend. Oh gosh, the money is getting low. Okay, good. We're betrothed. Okay. An heir. Fantastic. Great. Fantastic. Okay, we've got to save the queen. Oh dear. Okay. If you say so. Right. Okay, Grecian Your Majesty. What is it? Tell me quick. Oh gosh, the people are going to run out again. Oh gosh. Wow, it's so... it's It goes down so fast. I, I think we just need to be... We need to almost be like flipping every second to try and uh, keep a balance. Crusades definitely aren't easy. Um, and to end it, I'm not sure how we're going to do it. But uh, okay, delightful. Fantastic. We need to move... Uh, organize a grand dinner. Good idea. Great. Good idea. Okay. Diplomacy. Let's do both. Wow, the army went down so damn quick. Poor Harry. Oh my gosh, not so good for us. This is quite a difficult part of the game. <laughs> it's just like the spice trade all over again. Okay, no, that's crap. Okay, the money is going up again. That's not so great. Okay, great. People have gone down. That's not so good. Okay. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. Spring Festival. Fantastic. Um, okay, yes, you will get justice. Yes. Okay, Sultans would like to meet you in Lamascus. Yes, okay, maybe we can end this. The crusade has to stop. Take the treasure if you will. Okay, yes, we shall. Oh my gosh, we made it out of it. The peacemaker, George, George brought that to an end. Oh, okay. Thank you, Princess Camuria. She handed over the keys to Lamascus's treasure and whispered, looking at you straight on it, looking at you, choke on it. Okay, so George the Peacemaker brought an end to what his uh, probably great-grandfather brought about, the start of this crusade. Um, so he's been in year for seven. He's been in. He's been in power for seven years. I can start. I can finally start to think now. We have a lot of money, so we should be able to try and spend that. But now we can actually start to relax and enjoy the game a little bit. <laughs> okay, all right. The miners are refusing to dig in the mine. They want a raise. You know what? We can actually afford to give them one. There you go. A covenant of nuns has started meowing like cats is spreading to the village. Um. Okay, General. Why should I? Why would? Why would I care? Why would I care? Let them. Let them. Let them meow away. It's okay. Our enemies want a peace treaty. This is the best way to end the war. Um, yep, yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Oh, great. A great fire is destroying your castle, my lord. Save the garrison, save the treasury. Um, we will save the garrison. Okay, let's see. A group of fanatics have ransacked the hospital, pretending only God can heal them through uh, your holy... through... Ah. Uh, your holy church, my lord. Okay, great. Um, uh, yes or no? See, this is one of those weird things where... I don't know what the answer is because I don't know what the question is. A group of fanatics have ransacked the hospital pretending only God can heal them through your holy touch, my lord. Yes or no? Am I saying yes, only they can only be healed? I'm going to say no. <coughs> okay. All right. Sire, we should spend some money to build a communal barn to prevent famines. Yes, I think that's a fantastic idea. I'm glad we have the communal barn. That's good. That's good. Okay, dear. Vikings are attacking us. We should defend our kingdom from the north. Um, yes, we shall defend. Okay, money is getting a little bit low. All right, the archbishop is here. There's been an explosion in the capital. We don't know exactly what happened. Shall we close the si the gates of the city? Um, it will affect money badly, so no, we are going to. The Queen of the South would like to help us in our efforts to repel the invading armies. Um, yeah, that sounds like a fantastic idea. That's good. The doctor is conducting ungodly experiments in a hidden room. He must be stopped. I'm well aware of that. Um, yes. Ah, uh, 
dear. We we need our religion to come up a little bit, so we are gonna we are gonna take that hit. There's nothing wrong with this room. I have to conduct my experiment somewhere. At least be discreet. At least be discreet. There we go. Cereals are very cheap these days, my lord. You should adjust the price of bread. Uh, raise it slightly, double it. It's double it. I discovered a young genius painter. His works, his works is a true sign of the divine in this world. Bring him in. I'm busy. Ah, uh, bring him in. Gregorius. Okay, right, Gregorius. How are, how is Gregorius gonna sound? There's too many people. God damn. Okay, right, Gregorius. Okay, right, Gregorius, the painter. My name is Gregorius. I will change the world with my art and your money. Okay, Gregorius. Uh, yes, you shall. Is it going to bankrupt us? Very nearly. <laughs> I need to watch that. Okay. We should systematically blame the islander migrants for everything that's wrong with the kingdom. Um, I do, is that going to affect us? I'm going to say no. Yeah, see, I knew it was going to affect us positively because the migrants are going to help. Okay, General Pollen. There's been another execute, another explosion. We need to be able to use the church to help with the victims. Yes, yes, you shall. Okay. A large part of the country is worshipping false gods. We should burn the witches. No, you must not. Okay, Thomas Wright. Would you like to marry a princess from a neighboring kingdom. Yes, I think that'd be a fantastic idea. Let's do it. Okay, right. The population is scared by the terrorists. Please suspend the payment of taxes this year. Ah, you know what? Yes, we can do that. Well, everything else has gone down. Oh dear, werewolves. Okay, all right. Um, what's going to help us positively with religion? Oh gosh. No? All right. All right. The Eastern Baronies are attacking. We only prevail by enlisting the population. Sure, we'll balance it out. We discovered an unknown body in the dungeon. Its hands are missing. Shall we reinforce the garrison? Um, yeah, for now. We'll get out. Okay, let's see. You are so clever, my lord. You're an example to all of us. Uh, yes, get to the point. Yes. Oh dear, religion is so low. Gosh. I have a request. We gained a large mountainous land on the eastern border. Would you consider giving it to me? Um, it seems to be bad whenever we give him stuff, but we'll try. We'll try once again. Oh God. Damn it. <laughs> Every freaking time. Yep. Yep. He's at the head of the fucking horde. <laughs> God damn this son of a bitch. Should we send the army? Well, I think we're going to find out next time, guys and gals. We are desperately low on our religion. We really need to do some work. George the Peacemaker seems to be much more of a stable king. How long he can keep the kingdom alive? That we'll need to find out next time. I have been Rykon. You have all been awesome. And until next time, stay tuned.